Welcome back, everyone. Final Fantasy VIII. This is shit again. If you remember, we're, um, this, this What dude the fuck, Laguna? With the, uh, unfortunate leg cramping issue. And, uh, Julia invited us up to her room. Well then. So let's do that now. Oh, is he gonna leave? Is he gonna get a little leg cramp before he gets up there? One of the fucking steps, like a little bitch. I don't think he does. I can't remember now, actually. He can just say I don't like him. Yeah, he's he's still kind of a douche right now, though. I mean, these two are both very important characters. Well, not to me. Kind of. Not to me. They're not not important characters that we're going to see a whole bunch of Julia for the rest of the game. But she does have a tie to an important character, which we will learn soon. Is it Laguna? Well, I mean. If it's Laguna, I don't care. It's not, but... Good. You'll see. We'll learn who Julia is very soon. Which also corresponds with one of the best songs that's ever been written for the Final Fantasy series. I'm the only one with vocals. Absolutely. Until, I think, Final Fantasy X. I think they well, we never count that. that. Oh, yeah. I actually just started playing Ten again. Oh, nice. I bought the uh, HD remix for PS3. Starting with the Expert Sphere Grid. I, I've never tried that before, so that's going to be a lot of fun. Everybody starts right in the middle with Lancet. Yeah. So you can just kind of build them however the hell you want. If you want a White Mage Auron, go right ahead. Yeah. Fuck Auron. It's going to be pretty cool. I'm excited. And I'm excited to play a hell of a lot of Blitz Ball. I'm actually playing that exact same game right now. Yeah. Except on the PS4. Yeah. But it's it's Final Fantasy X. I don't think it makes a difference. Not really. I was going to get the PS4 one, but I couldn't justify the thirty dollars just because of the console difference. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna pay thirty bucks, get it on the PS3, and still have a great time. I don't own a PS3, therefore yeah. I have to. Yeah. There you go. I couldn't justify the three hundred dollars to get a PS3. <laughs> Final Fantasy X remake. There you go. I have a PSP. Oh yeah, Laguna here is confessing his dream of quitting the army and becoming a journalist. Typical, typical bitch Laguna move. Typical bitch Laguna move. <laughs> I actually, I really like Laguna in Dissidia. He's a great character. He plays an interesting role in this one. He, he, he plays an interesting role in Dissidia, just not a good one. <laughs> Laguna passed out. Everybody's got clothes on. That's great. I was showing you the comments because you were asking what I was laughing at. No, they're just going to keep talking a bit. This part of the game is unfortunately a tiny bit slow. Can't really help that, but we'll get past it pretty quick. Julia and Laguna. What happens in the story? Yeah, Julia and Laguna are talking about their dreams. Julia wants to be a singer, not just a piano player. <laughs> Laguna, unfortunately, is Laguna. Laguna. They get all sappy. Oh yeah, I see this. This is great. <laughs> there is a wonderful, wonderful beer being opened right now, and I'm very excited. I love when they have corks. Okay, let's get past this stuff. Oh, and we're done the dream sequence. Everybody's awake. Well, Squall is the last one to wake. What up, Zell? Oh, you'll like this comment. <coughs> yeah. Right here. This is for you, Nathan. Yes, it is. Were we all asleep? No. No, 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 no. Keep reading. Yeah. I'm reading. Don't you worry. A lot of people who resent seed. Better mm. be careful. Am I missing anything? Is anybody hurt? Don't think so. Now I wonder why all three of them fell asleep, right? Where's the Nathan comment? You'll see. I had such a nice dream. 
How did Selfie join your party again? I had a dream too. It wasn't nice though. How did Selfie join your party? I dreamt I was a moron. <laughs> there you go. Man. There you go. There you go. Just for you, Ginger. Just for you. There you go. Fuck a Laguna. Yeah. Uh, Selfie joined your party because she was trying to find Cipher during the exam to give him information, and she just stuck with you. So. And, you, so. And you, she also she passed the exam too and became seed, and she so just. So you of your took school. her along with you. Basically. So you took a selfie. I took a selfie. <laughs> And we are now arriving in Timber. Oh, and Selfie just said Sir Laguna was so cool. Now they're all realizing they all three of them had the exact same dream at the same time. Laguna war. Huh? Games. Yeah. Huh? So more than just a dream. What's that? We're just going to brush this aside for now because honestly it's not important yet. Put this in on hold. Psych yourself up, baby. Oh my god, you're a douche. He is a little bit. A little bit? I just, I, I can't care because he's my powerhouse for the whole game. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, these three people are my team for the foreseeable future of this game. I often trade Selfie for Renoa, but fuck it. Later, yes. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. Yes. fucking Awesome. I fucking love that game. Although that game Trains will, don't stop that fast! That game will also require a lot of off-camera grinding for me. Yes, and a significant amount of time. Yeah. It is a long-ass game, but Legend of Dragoon. Oh, yes. One of my all-time favorites. We'll have to, we'll have to, we'll have to, we'll have to wait for some time. Yeah, that'll, that'll be much later down the road if we do play it. Because we don't want to saturate this with long-ass RPGs. We've got some one-off shit coming up in the future. Oh, yeah. We'll have... We've got plenty of content coming up, don't you babies worry? We have literally every game ever, so we'll find stuff and stuff to play. But the Moogles are here! Now, do you remember the call sign? The forests of timber sure have changed. I think it's the Cocobos of Cocobos is there. You would be wrong. But the owls are still around. The timber owls, the resistance move. Well, good thing I was paying attention. <laughs> good fucking thing you were paying attention. What would happen if you got that wrong? Um, I don't think anything really happens. Would they ask you again like every yeah. other RPG does? Yeah, I think they just keep asking until you fucking do it right. Don't be that. Don't be that way. How would you go talk to my kid? No. Oh, come on! Don't be that way. How'd you go talk to my kid? <laughs> zone. We are. Who the seen. fuck names their child Zone? Who names their child Squall, Zell, or Selfie? I'd rather Squall than Zone. I'd rather not be an area of. I'd rather not be an area of a place. <laughs> Which SquareSoft character has a name? Uh, Final Fantasy VI. Sid? Any incarnation Sid, okay, of Sid? Sid is a real name. Yeah. Sid is a real name. Tara, uh, Tara Vincent. isn't bad. Vincent from Seven. Vincent is Vincent. Tara is not spelled in the traditional manner, though. T E R R A. The traditional manner is spelled in Tara T A R A for yeah. people's names. Whatever. Edgar. Edgar? That's, a, that's a decent Edgar. one. Okay, yeah. Edward from Four. Edward from Four, yes. Kane? I have, I have I've, I've met a Kane. Uh, Cecil. I've met a few of those. There's still a few in far between. Yeah. Maria. You don't need from a lot two. of locks. You don't need a no. lot of No. Maria from Cyan. two. Cyan. Richard, yeah. Richard. Shadow. Richard from two. Yeah, yeah. Who Richard. Who names your kid fucking Shadow? Tifa. That's you name your dog. That's Dude, not, no. When I was in elementary school, actually, I had a guy in my class named Shadow. I fucking shit disgusting. you not. See, see, in Shadow's case, that's not actually his name name, but he's, remember, he's an assassin. Point to me an assassin he uses their real name. True. That is actually a real assassin and not a scheduled clad bimbo from a certain fighting game we're not going to mention. You know what? If you use your real name as an assassin, that's probably the most badass way there is. Like, probably. Everyone expects you to use a fake name, so if you use your real name, they're going to assume it's a fake name. No one will put two and two together. Either that or be like, holy crap, this guy's actually putting his name out there? He's got to be that badass. He puts it out there all the time. There's actually a theory that the that's not his actual name. Yeah. 
Um. Oh shit! Is everything? Okay, everybody got their stuff on Junction. So he gets Ifrit, and I'm gonna give him Diablos just because I can. Um, let's see, what am I doing here? Oh yeah, he gets Tornado, and on Magic. Uh, what should I give him? He doesn't really have that... Oh, check, check in the S40. Yeah, I know. I just have to give him stuff. Okay, well, I'm just gonna give him Blazaga magic on his elemental. GF, draw, item. Yep, there it is. I remember, I learned strength 40. So now, oh! Because I equipped Diablos, <laughs> he gets a third ability slot. So he gets strength 60, 60 40, 156 strength. This is gonna be stupid. This is gonna be fucking stupid. More than usual. Oh, oh yeah, and I don't want Quistis, fuck you. Selfie. Uh, you get Shiva for now, and that's it. And on your strength, you also get Tornadoes. You don't have a lot of magic, so I'm just gonna have a blind on your spirit. That's all I can do. You are GF, draw, magic, strength plus 60. Let's come back to Squall. You have. I don't think you got shit going on for you right now. Death, Asuna, water. I'm actually going to give him back a card. I know I don't use it often, but I don't care about his magic. I don't care about items very often. So I'm just going to give him a card. That way I can keep doing card. Just keep getting stuff for refinable abilities. We'll just roll with it. I'm sure it's good. Okay. Here is... Another incredibly important member of my party. One I actually will be using often. Is it Renoa? Here's Renoa. She's the one from the really tiny white dress at the dance. Oh, you're that one. The one that I questioned. Yeah. Bam, chicka, bam, bam. Yeah, pretty but, much. Putting the wow wow with bam, chicka. <laughs> <laughs> I seriously had a crush on this fictional character when I was a teenager. Oh, yeah, of course. Do. Absolutely. Cloud. Tifa. <laughs> yeah, okay. Cloud, I have such a ridiculous crush on him. So no, it's funny. Fuck, have you seen that art? <laughs> yeah, I have seen some Salazar actually. Yeah. Oh, and this is where she confesses that she knows Cypher. I don't know if we ever explained that before. I think the game explains that eventually too, but that's because Renoa and Cypher were dating. <laughs> Probably. Okay, so now I kind of have her on my party. We'll learn a few things. I'm not gonna now. There we go. Okay. Now we're going to learn of the reason why we're here. I think people, mankind has been asking that question for millennia. Probably, but I mean... No, we actually have. Fuck so it. It's so existential it hurts. So existential. Much questioning. Wow. wow. And she has a dog. She does. I love that fucking dog, man. She's she a fucking dog! It doesn't have a tail. What happened to you? Did somebody magic your tail away? Probably. Where's or... your tail? Angelo. The fact I that mean, it gets... that's like the best thing about being a critter is having a tail. Where is your tail? Remember I was talking about Renoa's Limit Break, Angelo Cannon? That dog explodes on a regular basis. I thought you, I thought she was going to throw the, throw the dog at someone. <laughs> she kind of does. She <laughs> kind of does. Cannon Fighter is. token. Her Limit Break uses Angelo. Fighter token. So she can learn new things. Oh my god. Angelo is Interceptor. Yeah. There you go. Seriously, we're playing that game. Okay. Like a motherfucker. Sweet. Okay, I'm playing that game. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so she learns limit breaks kind of weirdly. Like, you can learn them from the new Pet Pals magazines you can find. But then you have to, like, walk around with her so she actually learns it. What kind of shit is that? Yeah, it's not like AP growth or anything. It's just time. 
Those are the worst. Okay, I actually like that gun right there. Uh, fuck tutorials. Come on, get rid of the tutorial. I actually like that. It's not done. Okay, let's get into some actual action here. This is going to be a very story-centric episode, but shit like that happens in RPGs. That's kind of neat. We're making a political cartoon. I'm going to use our new uh, head of our faculty arts association. Excellent. Can I leave him with, with, with like, just have to close the eyes? Uh, I probably should have hit that save point, but whatever. But he's also a friend of me. I haven't really done all that much. <laughs> no, we've done a lot of story you don't want to have to redo or something like that. Maybe I shouldn't have done this on graphics. Yeah, true. But if shit goes south, I'll just do it off camera. And thus another internet star is born. If you end up publishing it. Where are we sitting at the time here? Uh, okay, we can probably listen to the explanations and then call it quits there. Okay. Now this is a, a pretty pretty solid plan here. I think you'll want to pay attention to this. What if we mention? There's going to be a VIP from the Galbadian army. Is that what you mean? Galbadian? Galbadian. Oh, yeah. Galbadia with a D. It's going to be the president. El president. People come gifting bears. Gifting <laughs> bears. Not from Albania, from Russia. Albania is not Slavic. Now check out this little graphic that they planned. Wait, is it? Blow it to smithereens with a rocket launcher. <laughs> oh, selfie, you're crazy bastard. Selfie. So, no. Oh, okay. Here is the plan in full detail. There's the base where we are right now. Base. There's a dummy car. Dummy. <laughs> what we have to do is get to the president's train. This was an annoying mission. In the Dark Record Keeper. Oh it's even more annoying here. Oh my god. There's the first escort, second escort, and president's car. We're going to seize the president's car. There are seven steps. Sneak on board the second escort. Sneak on board the president's car. I don't know if you can follow this plan just yet. <laughs> this is actually much more badass when you actually do the, the mission and everything happens. And you get the full motion video. It's pretty crazy. We're going to uncouple a moving train, move a second train into the middle of all the trains, connect said train to your train, uncouple the train again, make off with the car, make off, uncouple the last car, let it recouple with the original train, and fucking take off. Fuck your laws about trains actually work. <laughs> oh yeah, no, physics don't apply in <laughs> No, okay guys, hang on for a second. Square, if you're watching, <laughs> that's not how trains work. Oh, wait, look, we get a list just in case you missed it. A list? Get in the. Oh. <laughs> a list of all the steps I missed. <laughs> <laughs> when you make a step, do you strike it from your. I, I, I don't even know. How, I don't even know how to continue with that. Step making. I wish I was clever enough making to. Making step. Make it uh, I, I don't know. Even know. I wish I was clever enough to come up with a good joke for that. <laughs> yeah. They're just talking about what's going to happen during the mission, but I know exactly how to do it, so... This is not how trains work. No. Like, not even a little. So I mean, basically, it just boils down to if there's a blue guy behind you, don't move. If there's a red guy behind below you, move. I mean, like, trains are... I mean, planes are my deal, not trains, but I'm pretty sure that's not how... No, it's not. This is Final Fantasy. 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 <laughs> Fantasy. 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 
is It's a literal fantasy? ocean of sugary drink. A literal ocean is of sugary drink. In a blank slide. Noah's cake from So this is where they explain how I do the uncoupling process. I just have to hit a couple of buttons. <laughs> We're gonna call it right here. There's just a little bit more tutorial. I, they're just gonna make me practice doing these buttons. I'm not gonna make you sit through that. Uh, so we'll stop it here. We'll come back in a couple of minutes. We'll see you next time on Final Fantasy VIII. Cheers.